Will Facebook offer to all of its users a blanket opt-in to share their privacy data with any third-party users? Congresswoman, yes, that's how our platform works. You have to opt in to sign into any app before you use it. Well, let, let me just add that it is a minefield in order to do that. And you have to make it transparent, clear, in pedestrian language, just once. This is what we will do with your data. Do you want this to happen or not? Was there a directive to put a bias in? And first, are you aware of this bias that many people have looked at and analyzed and seen? Congressman, this is a really important question. There is absolutely no directive in any of the changes that we make to have a bias in anything that we do. Your platform is still being used to circumvent the law and allow people to buy highly addictive drugs without a prescription. You know, with all due respect, Facebook is actually enabling an illegal activity and in so doing, you are hurting people. Would you agree with that statement? Congressman, I think that there are a number of areas of content that we need to do a better job policing on our service. Facebook has detailed profiles on people who have never signed up for Facebook, yes or no? Uh, Congressman, in, in general, we collect data of people who have not signed up for Facebook for security purposes to prevent the kind of scraping that you were just referring to. So these are called shadow profiles? Is that what they've been referred to by some? Uh, Congressman, I'm not. I'm not familiar with that. I'll refer, I'll refer to them as shadow profiles for today's uh, hearing. Well, if you don't, you're not listening to us on the phone, um, who is and do you have specific contracts with, with these companies that will provide data that you, is being acquired verbally through our, through our phones or now through things like Alexa or other, other products? Congressman, we're not collecting any information verbally on the microphone, and we don't have contracts with anyone else who is. As CEO, you didn't know some key facts. You didn't know about major court cases regarding your privacy policies against your company. You didn't know that the FTC doesn't have fining authority, and that Facebook could not have received fines for the 2011 consent order. You didn't know what a shadow profile was. You didn't know how many apps you need to audit. You did not know how many other firms have been sold data by Dr. Kogan, other than Cambridge Analytica and Inoya Technologies, even though you were asked that question yesterday. And yes, we were all paying attention yesterday. You don't even know all the kinds of information Facebook is collecting from its own users.